how the preach one day him and others on the on faith and after that preaching I have a dream that I have a job and within one week I secure a job without interview I just wrote this year I should come after service to come and negotiate my salary I was in charge of the making Bishop uh, the cha- I was the chairman of the when he wanted to become an inauguration. inauguration bishop something. Do you know that oh, God is too faithful? He didn't have a seat. The ministry. Amen. So one is divinely orchestrated. Mm-hmm. Secondly, he chose to obey. Mm-hmm. God never forces instructions on anyone. Mm-hmm. Each one makes his choice to obey or disobey. Yes. Mm-hmm. Thirdly, I had a clear witness in the spirit that God sent him to me. Amen. And that has been proved over time. Amen. And finally, we share a lot of common spiritual virtues, mm-hmm. such as undying passion for God. Yes. Yeah. Tireless passion for things of the kingdom. Yes. Yeah. And a burning passion for souls. Mm. The way you have stuck with this incredible man of God called Bishop David Oyedikbo. It excites me. I have watched you through the years. And I've seen your heart. And God sees your heart. David Abuye currently serves as the first vice president of the Living Faith Ministries worldwide. And he has impacted in not only the Living Faith Church, but also in many ministries in Nigeria, as attested by the contemporaries in the vineyard of God. Humble spirit, being there for everyone, and uh, having an enabled position, combining humility, accessibility, and simplicity. I would like him to a chef who is presenting his food to his customers. He's not out to display his uh, cooking skills, but is interested in giving them what they need for nourishment. And much more importantly, he will present the food in a way that will whet your appetite. Uh, the aura around him inspires me. Um, his simplicity um, inspires me. His uniqueness inspires me. And of course, his servanthood. Um, I've never seen anyone exemplify it like Bishop David Abuye. He has truly helped us serving God under the prophet.